Okay, guys, um, this next one, um, I'm going to work on the top of the monkey bars. So if you look at page two of the Project Lead the Way 1.5.9a, um, and if you look at the schematics you're given, those are for the outside of the upright monkey bar. So those are actually the pieces that like make the ladder and if you um, flip over like I said to page two you can see on the far left where you have the rungs going up with the big gap at the top that that's the that's the picture that you're given okay um, but you can also see that the monkey bars are symmetrical and so the only thing that's different between the top of the monkey bars and that upright monkey bar, the latter side that you go up, um, is the number of holes. We can still get the rest of the dimensions off this engineering schematic. So I'm going to make the top right piece. And I only have to make one, and then I just drop it twice. And I see it as a long rectangle. So I'm going to start with a 2D sketch. I'm going to get my rectangle. I'm going to pull it out, and again, that engineering schematic, it tells me that it's 90 inches long. So I'm going to type 90, and then it also tells me, if you look at it, that where I thought, you know, you can see that from the edge to the center of the hole is 3 inches. Well, if you went from the center of the hole then to the other side, that's another three inches. So this whole pole is six inches tall. So I type 90 tab and now I'm typing six. And I'll click on the front here and it zooms out for me. Now, we need to look and see, yeah, so on the engineering schematic, it, uh, it gives us the depth too, but we're not quite ready to extrude it because hopefully what you saw last time is that um, we need to put the holes in first, right, before we, um, before we extrude anything, and that way it'll extrude the holes for us. So remember, I'm going to make start with points, and it looks like according to the document there that the holes are 10 inches apart and they're also 10 inches from the end. So remember get my little dashed line and I'm just going to start dropping points and I need seven of them. You might ask how in the world I know that. Again if you go to page two the project lead the way document and you look at the actually assembled monkey bars, if you count the rungs at the top, because that's what I'm making, one, two, four, five, six, there's seven. So I'm going to make a point, I'm going to come over, I'm going to make another point, that's three, four, five, six, seven. And right now I'm not worried about the distance. Remember, I'm going to use the dimension tool to take care of that for me. So I'm going to do this one, and this one, and it needs to be 10 inches apart. Oh, I got close. And then I'm going to do this one, and this one. I'm going to come down just because that's going to be easier. And this one. Oops, typo on my part. It should be one. Here.
But the problem is now we need one more. Fill the gap. That's all right. All right. Now, if you remember, our circles are two inches in diameter. So I'm going to grab my circle, lay them over my points. Remember, I'm looking for that green, and I'm going to type two. Just making circles. I know they don't look very big, but it has to do with the dimension of the box. Oops, got that up too high. Try it again. And the last one. There. All right. So I've got all my circles made. Finish my sketch. Get it more manageable. Remember on my engineering schematic at the bottom right corner, it's got the six by six. So I need to extrude. By six inches. Boom. And there's the top piece of the monkey bar. So I'm going to, if you want to change it color appearance go go for it and the front of this page says call it upright monkey bar is what it appears and then the other one is monkey ladder so we're going to save let's try again save come on there it is Remember, put it in your My Documents. I'm putting it on my desktop because I can't get to my Documents folder. So, Monkey Upright. Save. And then you're good to go. Okay? So, best of luck. I'll come back and we'll work on the ladder.